I'm Peter Raven. I'm uh, President Emeritus of the Missouri Botanical Garden, where I was for 39 years until I retired in 2010. And I'm also jo uh, significantly George Engelman Professor of Botany at Washington University from 1971 to 2010 also. Well, I headed the garden and I built a research program from relatively small beginnings to something with about 50 PhDs that was active all over the world with more emphasis on conservation and discovery and exploration, things that would have gladdened George Engelman's heart. And then at Washington University, I dealt mainly with graduate studies, but uh, gave lectures, taught a few courses, and generally encouraged environment. My research interests have been focused on plant evolution and ecology, and as my career has gone along, I got my PhD in 1960, uh, the field has developed greatly, as have all fields of biology, because of the appearance of molecular biology in the 1960s, and its application as a tool for solving the kinds of problems that would have been very familiar to George Engelman or William Trelease. It's fascinating how the field of botany has progressed over the years with the Academy of Sciences playing a big role in the beginning. Uh, George Engelman, who came here in 1834 to St. Louis after a couple of years in Illinois on the other side of the river and ultimately from Germany, uh, built exploration for plants and the science of botany strongly in St. Louis. Henry Shaw, who founded the garden, uh, established a professorship of botany at Washington University one year after Engelman died. He died in 1884 and the professorship was established in 1885. And Trelease continued on the development of botany which went on through the 19th century. Uh, Engelman began with uh, uh, form and function in plants. By the time Trelease was summarizing it, physiology had come into the picture, but of course, and it had advanced greatly. But of course, since then, a number of things have happened. First of all, plant ecology or ecology as a whole has appeared on the scene, which was really functionally unknown in the 19th century. And we've come to worry about things like sustainability and, uh, ev and uh, environmental services and ecology and resilience in communities. In the field of plant classification and evolution, which both Engelman and Trelease followed, uh, statistical methods, advanced statistical methods, exploration all over the world, which was fostered by both Engelman and Trelease uh, and has since extended to every corner of the earth, exploration all over the world, and then the application of statistical methods, the usefulness of computers in pulling back information about plants, or however it might be gathered, and finally, the application of molecular biology to their finer classification have all made huge differences during the course of the 20th and early 21st century.